uh, now to some new video just released showing the moment authorities close in on a triple murder suspect accused of killing a Charlotte woman and her two children. Benjamin Taylor, we have a war for your arrest. Come out with your hands up. Police arrested 34 year old Benjamin Taylor after uh, he was hiding out in a tent in Southern California. Queen City News anchor Robin Kennedy was the first to report on the camp where authorities found Taylor. She joins us now live in the studio to break down details of his arrest. Robin, this video really gives us a better understanding of his efforts to evade police. Exactly, Morgan. We told you about how that area where Taylor was found in California is really known as a hideout. Law enforcement found Taylor in the middle of the desert inside a tent. Benjamin Taylor! We have a war for your arrest. Come out with your hands up. On March 16th, police spread out, guns drawn in Slab City, an area of California yep. near Mexico that a journalist says is known for lawlessness. <laughs> Deputies shot smoke canisters at a Charlotte man, Benjamin Taylor, wanted for killing his girlfriend, Markayla Johnson, and her two young children, Miracle and Messiah. Their bodies were found in an apartment complex in Charlotte on March 15th. Hey guys, I have a shield in the back of my truck if we just want to go up there and open the tent. The FBI and the Imperial County California Sheriff's Office got a tip that Taylor was hiding out in Slab City, a place described as somewhere you go not to be found. Taylor, come out with your hands up! Slab City has multiple encampments for people living off the grid. Deputies found Taylor in a blue tent. It's right there. Now! Come out! Do not. Come out. Crawl. Do not reach Start anything. crawling. Move. Let's go. Start crawling towards us. Less than a minute later, deputies pulled Taylor out. Come here. Deputies and FBI agents surrounded Taylor. Knees up. Let's go. Come on. Sit up. And loaded him in a pickup. In a minute. It's at least your worries right now, okay? To take him to the Imperial County Jail, where he's facing three counts of murder from Charlotte. <sighs> Law enforcement officials told us the week after Taylor's arrest that he waived an extradition hearing and was awaiting transportation from California. CMPD told us today they don't have any information to share on the extradition process, so it's unclear when Taylor will return here to North Carolina. Morgan? Thank <laughs> you.